Is swimming uphill a thing? Hi, I'm Emma Stokes and it's week seven of my Dart 10K training. Um, so I've just completed my long swim of the week and I managed to do three and a half miles. Um, so really chuffed with that, although it was the swim from hell. <laughs> um, I've definitely got to change my uh, exercise regime. Um, I'm doing my Reforma Pilates on a Saturday and uh, I don't know if any of you have done Reforma Pilates, but it's hard. And my arms were absolutely done before I'd even got into the pool. Um, and I thought, no, no, it'll be fine. This swim will do them good. But it was such a struggle. I got to about, I think it was probably about two miles and I could feel myself really slowing down. There was just no gas in the tank today. Um, and my arms were hurting. Just this, it's this muscle here on my arms. Um, really, really hurting. Um, then I got to, I looked, stopped, looked at my watch and I'd done 4.6K. And I was like, right, okay, I'll just get to 5K. So I counted the lengths, got to 5K and then was like, maybe I'll just stop. Nah, I've only got to do 600 more meters. So I literally did 100 meters, considered it, got to four no, 5.5K and was like, oh God, no, maybe just four five and a half k's enough and then I was like oh but it's just two more lengths so I did two more lengths of absolute agony um halfway through my swim my mp3 player ran out of battery because I hadn't charged it up so then it was just nothing no tempo trainer <laughs> no music just my thoughts um and because I was in a little bit of a negative mind set because of how much it was hurting the thoughts weren't really helping me <laughs> I've got a question to ask. Does anybody else sometimes feel like in a swimming pool, there's an uphill and a downhill? Like, I mean, I know there isn't. <laughs> I know it's completely flat. But I seem to have this thing where I feel like when I'm going up to the deep end, it feels like an uphill struggle. And then when I'm swimming back towards the um, shallow end, I suddenly feel like it's so much easier. So I've considered that for quite a few lengths today as to whether there's an uphill and a downhill in a swimming pool. I mean, where does my mind even go? Crazy. Um, so yeah, update on the um, bone conducting MP3 player, which I've ordered, didn't turn up. So I emailed them twice and had no response. So I contacted PayPal. PayPal have been amazing and have actually refunded me. So I'm a little bit gutted that my bargain never showed up, but if something's too good to be true, it's usually good to, too good to be true. So I'm going to have to just either stick with my current MP3 player, which goes into my ears. And actually today it stayed put, so it was fine. Um, or go for the 100 quid option, which I'm not sure that's probably a good idea. Um, so that was that. And um yeah, so my swim today, when I looked at my watch at 5K, I was almost 10 minutes slower than my previous two 5K swims. So it was really not a good swim today. Um, but hey, we all have bad swims. Um, I've got uh, my stepdaughter's swimathon next Saturday, um, where apparently we're a team, we do relays. So that isn't really going to be my long swim, but I've cancelled Reforma Pilates because that's just going to be a step too far to then try and do my three and a half miles again next Sunday, because there's no way I can up the distance yet. I just need to get comfortable with that distance. Um, and on Wednesday, um, my Dark 10K training team, me, Zoe and Mandy, are hopefully all meeting up at the Lido after work and are going to do a little bit of a swim and then have a team chat. So I'm really looking forward to that. And I haven't really got any other news um, this week. You'll be pleased to know, so it's not a waffle. Um, but just to say, you know, don't get disheartened if you are um, training for a marathon swim like me. Um, we are all going to have bad weeks. And I came out of the pool feeling really quite flat 
and was like, am I ever going to get any better? Um, but now I've had time to think about it. I've had a massive roast dinner because I was starvacious after three and a half miles. Um, and yeah, I'm just going to put that one under the belt. I've done it. I've done the distance. It's not about the time. Um, and next week I'm going to have my MP3 player charged up and uh, I'm just going to try and enjoy it. So that's all from me this week. I will keep you posted on how our team swim goes on Wednesday. Over and out. My arms are so sore and tired.